Welcome back everyone! I made fractal vise jaws that can be 3D printed from metal and attached to any standard 6 inch vise. I'm sharing my designs for free so like, subscribe and let's get started. Fractal vices are expensive and very hard to find so I decided to make my own. The first step was to design the CAD file which you can download by following instructions in the link below. With the fractal jaws complete, I imported a general model of a vise and generated the attachments for it. In short, here's the final expected product. Now naturally, the next step is for us to test our designs, so I uploaded the files to my 3D printer software. I'm using a Formlabs Form 3 and I love it. If you're thinking of buying your own, I have a guaranteed $500 off coupon for you to use in the description below, so make sure you use it. Back to the vise, I printed the first set of parts and then processed it as per the Formlabs procedure. This is as easy as removing the printing platform once the print is complete, scraping the parts off of the build bed carefully as they're still relatively soft right out of the printer, and then throwing these printed parts in isopropyl alcohol tubs for cleaning. To speed up curing, I purchased a $30 oven from Amazon. I placed the prints inside and the heat expedited the hardening process. I also purchased the $17 405nm UV light which conveniently shines right through the glass door. Now we turn on the oven and we wait for the perfect high resolution parts. Once curing was over, the parts were removed from the oven and any leftover support material was sanded off. I found that using 1200 grit paper works really well for these prints. With sanding all done, the parts were tested and the designs did not disappoint. It works! So we went back and printed the rest of the parts on the Form 3 printer. One thing I want to note is that the Form 3 actually was designed with easy to break off supports. As an example, sanding down all these supports after they are hardened would have been such a pain. But check this out. Alright, we're now all done with the printer, so we return the printing platform and move on to Amazon.com, where we purchase a standard 6 inch vise. Of course, it conveniently arrived the next day, so I unpacked it, gave it a good clean down, and we were now ready to bring all our parts together for the final assembly. Let me know what to make next in the comments below and the idea with the most likes will be my next project. 